The Porsche Carrera GT had a production run from 2004 to 2007 with 1,270 units being produced. Porsche had thoughts of having a racing layman's prototype for the 1999 season with the intentions of a turbocharged flat 6 engine, but was later redesigned with a V10 pushing the project to the year 2000. This V10 was secretly built by Porsche for the Footwork Formula 1 team in 1992, but was shelved after deciding not to use it. With VW Audi chairman, Ferdinand Peach, not wanting company competition between Porsche and Audi's Le Mans prototype, the Audi R8, the Le Mans project for Porsche was cancelled again. Porsche then used their V10 engine in their prototype car called the Carrera GT and was first revealed at the 2000 Paris Motor Show. The concept car, designed by Harm Log II, used a 5.5-liter V10 whereas the road legal versions were a 5.7-liter V10. There were only two prototypes ever made. One of them was sold to Jerry Seinfeld in 2007, a Porsche enthusiast, but Porsche removed the engine control computer, also known as ECU, so that it is underivable. It was a fully functioning prototype with the chassis number being 9R3M001. Seinfeld sent it to auction in 2016, but it did not meet the reserve. The car has an estimated worth of $1.5 to $2 million. A Carrera GT prototype was displayed at the Peterson Automotive Museum in Los Angeles, California in 2018 loaned by racing driver Bruce Canepa. With limited information on the car, it is hard to say if that car was Seinfeld's previous car or the second prototype. Nonetheless, it is a unique car which led to one of Porsche's legendary cars to ever be built.